Scott was in class, he would constantly play with and destroy his eraser. Frustrated by his fidgeting, Scott's teacher told his mum he had behavioural issues. Why couldn't he sit still and listen? Luckily, Scott's mum knew he was a kinesthetic learner. He needed to be able to move to learn. She suggested Scott squeeze a stress ball or draw while his teacher was giving lessons. As a result, Scott's grades improved and he flourished. For another child, the outcome might have been very different. As supervisors, we need to acknowledge that intelligence is diverse. Some of us think visually through sound or like Scott, through movement. There is no right or wrong learning style, just a style that's right for your learner. Taking time to understand your apprentice or trainee's learning styles will make training easier and more effective. It will show that you're invested in their progress and their success. Fleming's visual auditory kinesthetic model is widely used to understand the different ways we learn. So firstly, let's think about how you best learn. When you assemble new furniture, do you study all the steps before you begin? Do you ask someone to read out the instructions? Or do you just start putting it together? When you're going somewhere new, do you look at Google Maps? Do you ask someone to explain how to get there? Or do you walk, drive or bike ahead of time? Visual learners prefer diagrams, pictures, demonstrations and films. They say, show me and let's have a look at that. They best perform a new task after reading instructions or watching someone do it while taking notes. Auditory learners prefer words, sounds and music. They say, tell me and let's talk it over. They best perform a new task after listening to instructions or discussing a process. Kinesthetic learners prefer doing, moving and hands-on experiences. They say, let me try and they best perform a new task by role-playing or trying it out and learning as they go. Download our self-assessment guide to learning styles to figure out how you best learn. When you're aware of your own learning style, you can help your learner understand theirs and adapt your training accordingly. Making these allowances will have a lasting effect on your learner. You'll inspire curiosity and motivation, while everyone at work will benefit from increasing morale, greater productivity, and reduce staff absence.